What's up guys, this is the Rifleman and I am back bringing you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as the United States. So the run off happened last time, we continued our push into Russia, we've got forces advancing on Moscow, and we're effectively driving them back on all fronts, yes. this guy here covering the riverside. Um, so what I want to do is have a bit of a check what's going on. So they're ready to engage this force, but really want this, get this force coming from the north, which we need to, need to think about. These guys are replenishing, and when they're ready to replenish, they'll move on and hit Tarki, and one will head east and mop out the rear areas, and one will head north, either attacking Moscow or helping to clear out some raiding forces. And I think, oh yes, these guys are on the way to Esfahan. You got very badly mauled, so you will fall back. So you can replenish. Sir, You're going to be ready to move up. You're also moving up. And these guys are just kind of forming a bit of a... A bit of a reserve. Uh, these guys are recruiting some artillery and they'll be ready to move. So that's all in a good position. Then let's go up to Scandinavia. So I cannot cross this stretch because I think he's blocking me. Make ready. Because it's not something I can do. But if I take this fleet with firsts and first, second, and thirds, go here. And sail there, Captain. Can I Chips take them by sea? Take them by sea. Can't do that, General. Fleet nope, ready. Because the understood. Okay. Aye, so let's sir. take you. Okay, this is going to be a bit more risky. So let's get you up here. Wait, let's pick my strongest sir. army because they there is a chance ready. they will be immediately ready. engaged. Your humble so it'll probably be ready for orders. Make ready. You, at the ready. Let's go for you. Because all I want to do is drop them off sir. here. Leave away, boys. Setting up Leave away. Something this like that. Ship, that sir. will be enough. Good, because then we can move on, on to Copenhagen ready. in force. I don't want to ah, land straight on the island because then I'll probably aye, get engaged. Aye, aye, yes, sir. So let's Shake do like this. In position. Officer on deck. There we go. Let's get you in port. Aye, aye, you can. These guys can wait because they're not really an army, so they can just kind of hold the fort. But apart from that, I think we need to do a bit more um, assault things. Let's take this army to Noel Browning, and they will assault Riga. And Riga's improved settlement fortifications, and he got mortars. But we have lots of troops, so let's capture Riga. And Russia. So you've had uh, one to two turns of, and they've not really had a chance to perform much of a counter attack because you managed to storm in and do a devastating amount of damage. Um, so Russia will be knocked out, but I would like, well, I will need to begin uh, operations against the Maratha Confederacy, just bastion of enemy action. So let's take, okay, let's capture this corner. Drop these guys off. Ooh, ooh. Heavy horse, how it's their artillery. Good. So my grenadiers and my engineers will go in, will go in over the flank. With these guys in reserve, well in, in, in support rather. So let's just do that. Let's do these guys are going to cover the artillery from this side. You guys are going to cover my, my artillery, my full artillery from this flank. General to the rear. Let's engage. So you guys start knocking down a hole in the wall. You guys are going to quick climb anyone you can. I'll probably be this section of the wall. So who did hit him first with a battery fire? Oh yes, first first try. Wow. You got provincial militia inside. Oh, yep. Yeah. So they are just targeting my infantry, which is good because they will stand there and take it. We should knock through this wall in good order, especially if they're going to spend their time. Uh, waste their time fleeing and moving around. And let's change targets. 
because right now the Howitzers have no reason to continue targeting this unit because there's only 41 of them left. Cognizant of these mortars. I'm wondering, I'm curious if I switch these guys to, to uh, round shot if they can actually hit them. Because uh, they may be able to. Sorry about that, guys. World of Warships decided to update itself. Okie dokie, so the section of the wall's going down. Quick lines coming in. Doing lots and lots and lots of good damage. Oh man. How many units do you have now? Four men left. Four men. Four poor souls. So what I might do is switch you to round shot. Okay, they haven't hit the militia or start to hit the uh, Royal Chassier Guard in the centre. So I might let them try to hit the mortars and then maybe set you to do round shot and hit the Royal Chassier Guard because it's heavy cavalry. So you may as well have a go. Sir. I don't know how, what effect special shot has on reload rates. To be honest, it's not something I've actually ever thought about that much. So we're getting regular round shot off. Ah, you're the quick climb there, my friend. So these guys are hitting the mortars, but I'm probably gonna take them off and instead go quick climb shot, garrison militia. And then let's. It's a long way to run them and they will be exhausted. But it's worthwhile doing. Yep, so this one keeps. You keep dropping your round shot in there. Wowzers. I'm tempted to send these guys that way because these chaps will be enough to cover the breach. Especially if they're going to send a garrison militia out to get me. So my route of foot artillery. I would do canister shot, but they will kill my own men, so at least if I do round shot. Oh no, they're slightly raised. Let's try a round shot and see what sort of trajectory it takes. Oh no, it does get lobbed. I was concerned it would have more of a directed arc. Okay, so this guard unit of engineers. You run here and be ready to not do anything except form square. Same with you. This going to unit scale the walls. You scale the walls. You scale and you scale. Let's push up. From one unit here, ready to form, form square. And you go up here. You start. Uh, let's get all the artillery to start hitting this. Oh no. Crossiers have been knocked down. Let's get some of the Crossier guards endangered, in danger. How it's just to the rear. Weirdly, not really deploying them either. Good deploy stakes, but. Meh. Just form square. That's just as good. Good enough. Let's get them all doing round shot. Oh yeah, the 
they're starting to drop. Yeah, they're dropping quicklime on me, so me. Oh, you are not going to be very poorly. But if your job is to suck up. If your job is to suck up damage, then. Okay, let's bring these guys in to engage the fusiliers. Let's turn off fire at will. It's going to you to climb that section of the wall, you to climb this section of the wall. Instead, you go here, ready to form a square. Then, when the blunderbusters have captured it, oh god, I haven't done you guys yet. I forgot about you guys. Okay, well I'm gonna do this then. Run you over here. Get my, this infantry unit to run over here to capture this gatehouse. Uh oh, pathfinding. Pull back. Pull back from the combat. Because <laughs> ultimately they may chase us. Right, so gonna have, we are going to have militia charging us, but we are pretty darn good. You form square, because... Cavalry's coming. These guys, it doesn't matter so much because they will get on the wall. Yeah, Pathfinding being screwy again. Don't, I'm guessing these guys don't quite know where they can go. Okay, let's take you. Commit. Let's get my grenadiers and my engineers into the combat. Run these guys over here on top of the wall. Good, we've captured a section of the wall. So we can just do something like this. Oh no, don't try run. Don't try. No, 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 no. These guys are going to try run through the door. Get back to the ropes. And fly. Blunderbusses. Oh yeah, they're climbing the wall. Silly me. Okay, you engage the fusiliers, you should win. Get through the gates. When these guys are ready, they'll shoot down and kill the grenadiers. So I'd to run you guys down here anyway. It may, at the very least, make them spread their grenadiers out different sections of rope. Good, let's charge these guys in through the gate, because it is now ours. Oh, the militia, have they climbed up the... Okay, they're going to try and flee through my own ropes. Let them... Well, combatants aren't even, allegedly. So obviously one of them is going to run here and immediately engage these guys in melee combat. Get out there and engage. Engage the guns as one big group. They'll have more of a chance surviving as one big group. That's a big militia unit, so I don't quite think they'll make it. They'll kill all them in time. These guys have, so they're going to charge through the breach because they're being mortared to hell. You guys go on square. These guys, you guys, make ready. Delicious. So you engage the artillery. Wait for you guys run up and hit these guns. Same with you. You may as well just roll on. Oh, 
god, that's a big old block of Americans dead. Because at the very least, I want my infantry to be together. Come on, just kill the mortar garrison. Because eventually, the Cuirassier Guards are going to get in the mix. Go and kill that last foot. Oh, that's a guy. Come on, everyone should be having a grand old time. Probably these guys on the wall. Might be them who do it on the wall. Okay, let's halt. No, don't halt fire with you. The, so, breaches usually suck. So, if I just run out of the breach. <gasps> yeah, there we go. Beauty. There we go. The cavalry's got involved. So everyone. Go for the Cuirassier Guard. There's one gun team, but they will get destroyed in the melee. See, so they are winning because they're very, very good cavalry and they're very good at chopping. But there's only so much chopping they can do, especially against grenadiers, and just this much infantry. Some engineers here doing it against the militia. Yeah, it's winning decisively, so our casualties will be high, but they'll only be able to take so many so many casualties before they just start to... So yes, we could do a bit more something more smart and route around and try and golf them. You see they are encouraged by the amount of kills they're doing. But damn. You guys got out of formation. Oh, they've been shot in the back by my line infantry. Good. And that's the gen is that the general killed? No, the general's over here. They're gone, they're gone, they're gone. I believe that's everyone. Beautiful. So we have captured Riga. St. Petersburg. So we'll want to run an army up into there rapidly, because that's where there's a big a big concentration of Russian troops on, in this... There you go. So everyone replenish. Good. Perfect. Let's rebuild. You're rebuilding. Got a massive navy in there, but you know what? You carry on. I don't need a naval dockyard. So that sort of secured your position. You'll be going after them. You're being replenished. You're replenished, you're going to go raid. This guy's going to Ankara. Oh, I think I was concerned about these guys trying to do something sneaky. Um, but I think... I don't know, we are, we are assaulting them at Minsk. We know what, I'm going to hit end turn and see what happens. Oh, my spy is going to have a sneaky look at the York, uh, York, York, uh, York town. That's the one. Yangs in the Black Hills. Our orders have become too unhappy. Alrighty, guys, and we're back. You and they're either. unhappy in Courland, or they were until I destroyed their school. So let's build a church school there to keep the religious happiness on the go. So the main things that happen is these guys shuffled around a lot here in Finland. Um, this army moved up from the east to help try to defend the west. The AI has done usual sneaky sneak tactics and ran around my army here because they'd rather do some raiding. So what I want to do is well, actually you yes, sir. send you no lances to examine Drew. Moscow. Waiting Moscow's... Oh my god, they don't even have a garrison. We don't even want much of a garrison. Oh god, look at that. That's beautiful. It means that these guys can be freed up to actually engage these armies to the south. And they're actually quite nice little armies. They've got rockets. 
So you're a bit mauled. Sir. You're only you, your, your only damage is really here. Oh, actually no, there's a bit more. So what I might do is move you up. Make ready. Mark. So you, I will take these four elites out. Some of these four line units out. Get rid of these four. Citizen. More orders. March. I will take Sir. Your one orders. of your artillery crews. Hey, ready for your ready and, for and yeah, they're not very damaged. I think. Yes. Men. Oh, wait a minute. Forward. At the ready. So we need to lose one more of you. Okay, I'll lose that light infantry. Forward, yes. You guys March. go here. Good. These guys, while not in good position, they'll go here. We're ready, ready Officer. to provide a reinforcement. And oh, what do I want to do first? So, judging by my segment time, I'm probably going to want to take Moscow first. Well, I mean, that's quite a... As underwhelming as it is to auto-resolve Moscow, that's just a really lame garrison. Like, yeah... Sorry, guys. Proud and victorious. That is, that was, I know it was lame, but it would have been so underwhelming to actually play that battle. Just, just do that, do that, do that. Fix everything, destroy my seminary, destroy the university, destroy the seminary. Building, please, another cemetery. Well, seminary, not cemetery. Cool. So what I might actually do is send. The ready. Sir. Okay, before I do that, maybe raid in the mines. Yeah, they're doing some sneaky sneak raiding, but that's okay. I'm not so bothered about them doing that. Farmland raid. Yep. Yeah. Call end is under is being raided, which is good. Let's try and break the seminary. See if they'll let us. What have you built? Oh, the Americas. I forgot the Americas were a thing. So let's just keep. Ooh. Yes. Yes, you are an army. Keep going on. So you're probably going to go over here, actually. They've got enough armies to destroy them in the north, so I want to start moving some armies to the east. Yeah, I've upgraded you. Major fisheries. Top level. Top level buildings. You're upgraded. You're upgraded. You're upgraded. Weaver's Cottage now. Gonkin Territory. And. Church called in Crimea. Good. And it's just tax you. Good. Let's hop over to the Americas for a minute. Let's build that. And then you. Now you might have one more turn of replenishment, and then you'll you'll move in and try hit. Or do I just move you in anyway? Just do this. Declare war. because they'll have another turn of replenishment before you get into range. The Pueblo nations have abandoned their allies, but that does not matter because we are going to declare on them anyway. Good. Well, my action... Oh, no. Let's leave it for now. Kidoki. In this army, you are going to go... If I leave La Louisiana... If I make you all leave Upper Louisiana, will you freak out? Mark. No, you will not. Mark. And we're not having any luck trying to convert you because we can't damn seminary destroy. Cool. So I you get in. The Lord's will. You can move on. up to... Where's the nearest border? It's up here. Where is their border? Ah, this. So you go up to here. Begin the move. Let's get a spy still on the go. Got these pirates ready to take out the Navajo. You're all good. Okay, so. Yes, sir. Let's do a bit of. Uh, no, to be honest, you could all you, you could both do with a bit of fixing up. Okay, so let's make. Okay, let's scoot you over here. Make, ready. make way for this army into Gifford Bloodknock. Can't do it, sir. 
So he can move up and take the brunt of the next attack. And to be honest, is, is this Persia's only region? It is. So if I take it, uh, it will be the end of this army up here too. Oh, that's a great church school. So you are almost ready. And then we'll have four stacks ready to move on on the Indian factions. And to be honest, it could do with just destroying this to open up to open up my region down here. Um, but I've already got anything I can useful I can do that with. I know you're ready to rock and roll, but to be honest, I'd rather if I'm gonna hit India, I wanna hit them in one go, one massive assault. So they've rioted in Courland. You've broken the steam engine factory. So path blocked over here. Path blocked over. Ah yes, you guys are actually okay Sir. now. Sir. Okay, so I wanna do my Order. attack with Make ready. Ready and awaiting what So you've got regular twenty four pounders, ready you've for... got thirty two pounder horse artillery. So you are the guys who want to do the assault. Prepare for war. So let's maintain That's siege. Ready. Make ready for maintain battle. Siege. Make ready. Let's them all maintain You're siege. And I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pick siege you, Goodwin Chanside. I think I'm gonna pick you to assault Copenhagen. Then once we hit Copenhagen, storm and hit the Swedes. So then these forces that I've definitely not forgotten up here in Iceland will hit Norway. And these three stacks will immediately march on Sweden right to knock them out of the game as well with a very lovely looking Swedish army in there. So let's take you, they Goodwin Chenser. No, was it you? Yes, it was. No, wait, you've not got good artillery. Settlement good foot artillery, that is. Maybe it might be you, Ralph Cribb. So let's use you. But looking at the timer, I believe that's the end of this part. So thanks for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you next time for the Assault on Copenhagen. Cheers, guys.